Hey everybody, Unraveling the Matrix here. I'd like to do another video about Scott Stapp and uh, the trouble he's going through recently. As we know, Scott Stapp believes that he has been a victim of embezzlement, theft, a conspiracy to ruin his life and his career. His wife alleges th that he believes he is part of the CIA and that he w was ordered or programmed somehow to assassinate President Obama. Now, I've done several videos and studies on mind control, brainwashing, and uh, targeted individuals. And I wanted to look further, not at Scott Stapp himself, but at Scott's wife, Jocelyn. And here's where I made some startling discoveries. It's not so much his wife himself, herself. Uh, she's a beauty queen. Uh, she's a, phil a philanthropist. She is a part of numerous charities and organizations here. Basketball Rock benefiting the Scott Stapp with arms wide open. Muscular Dystrophy, Jorge Posada Foundation, Florida Hurricane Victims, uh, American Cancer Society making strides against breast cancer, the Andy Roddick Foundation. Big money, big, big money here. But here, this is on Wikipedia, it is where it gets interesting. Okay, his wife, uh, she's a beauty queen, New York beauty queen, Florida beauty queen, jo Jocelyn Nyschwatt. Okay, that's her maiden name. Now, she went to Baghdad in 2004 for the troops where she met her sister, Army Captain Julia Nyswat, who is now Deputy Assistant Secretary of State for Implementation, Bureau of Energy Resources, U.S. State Department. Now, let's look at Julia some more here. Here's Julia's biography directly from uh, the U.S. Department of State. Now, this is Scott Strapp's sister-in-law. Let's read through here this. Uh, Julia Nyswatt is currently the Deputy Assistant Secretary of State for Implementation in the Bureau of Energy Resources, where she has served since 2011. Beginning in 2008 through 11, Mrs. Nyswatt was a Senior Advisor and Chief of Staff to the Special Envoy for Eurasian Energy. Immediately prior, she also served as the Energy Policy Advisor in the Department of Economic Bureau, where she focused on energy security issues for Europe and Central Asia from 2010-2011, including a period following the Fukushima disaster. Mrs. Nyschwatt served as a Council on Foreign Relations Fellow in Japan. She's part of the CFR where she conducted energy and economic policy research evaluating U.S. and Asian energy policies. It gets better. Let's keep reading. Earlier in her career, Mrs. Nyschwatt was Chief of Staff for Policy and Planning at the Office of the Director of National Intelligence, where she worked on international energy security issues, including nuclear power and nonproliferation issues, she has also served on the U.S. Presidential Commission on Intelligence Capabilities regarding Weapons of Mass Destruction, where she led the North Korea Policy Steering Committee. A former U.S. Army military intelligence officer, Mrs. Nyschwatt served consecutive tours in Afghanistan and Iraq. She's got a B.A. from Stetson University, a master's degree, Georgetown University, a Ph.D., mechanical sciences, engineering, 
Tokyo Institute, Tokyo, Japan. She is, or was, on the Council of Foreign Relations. She, got, she has an extensive history in intelligence work, high up levels of intelligence, government jobs. She is a former military intelligence officer in the U.S. Army. That's his sister-in-law. That's his wife. Scott believes he has been targeted by the CIA, that he's a targeted individual. Look at the connections here, folks. The rabbit hole keeps getting deeper and deeper with Scott Stapp, the Scott Stapp story. Many people out there believe they are targeted individuals of brainwashing, mind control. What are the chances that Scott Stapp's sister-in-law is an intelligence agent? She's of the CFR. She's a government employee with the State Department. Some very interesting stuff here, folks. This has been Unraveling the Matrix. Hit like, share this video, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching.